Naval Station Everett's Port Operation Department, trained by simulating a full-scale oil spill contamination drill. Um, as port operations for the base, we're uh, responsible for all the harbor spills. We actually have uh, geographic uh, response plans that we, you know, we go up the rivers and we have protection strategies that we set. So this today was our, uh, our annual facility response team training. It's usually a week long. Uh, this year it was three days long. Uh, we train for the first couple days and the last day we, we come out and drill and we simulate an oil spill and we contain it and, uh, and, and collect it. The simulation was designed to prepare the facility response team and the oil spill response team to protect the environment and the water surrounding the naval station. During the drill, small boats work together to deploy an oil spill contamination boom. Yeah, so the boats we are using, that, they're all our oil spill response boats. So we have the utility boats, which were the, the little boats that you've seen around the, the outside of the boom today. Uh, our primary one is a skimmer. That's the one that's actually uh, collecting the oil and containing it, you know, in the storage tank. Um, we have our platform boat is the one that carries all the boom and brings it out to the site and deploys the boom. Oh, the, the oil absorbent pads, you know, those are meant for absorbing the oil, but for drill purposes we use it to actually simulate the product in the water. That way we know where to collect it. Um, and then, you know, all the boats work together as far as getting, it, getting into different maneuvers as far as collecting and containing the oil. The training was designed to be a refresher as well as to teach about new developments and techniques in environmental protection. From the Defense Media Activity, I'm Petty Officer Amara Timberlake.